Hear ye. <clears throat> you may kiss the bride. Is that what they say? I'm still Hear working ye. out a lot of the kinks. Work out the kinks. Welcome back to Twin Cities Live. Steve is working out the kinks because he's going to be For good reason. performing a wedding ceremony. I am practicing for a wedding. That I will officiate. The ceremony is going to air live on our show. I think let's pull back on the Hear Ye. Hear ye! It's happening in exactly 30 days. These two, Matt and Kay, they are going to tie the knot live on our show. So they won TCL's Trend Wedding. It is presented by the Wedding Guys. It's an unbelievable prize worth $25,000. Last Wednesday, the team from D'Amico Catering, they stopped by to offer three options for what their guests will dine on at the reception. <laughs> but Matt and Kay did not get to pick. You did. And boy, you made a great choice. They will have tasting stations throughout the room. One will have flatbreads and other features, a chef making various types of gnocchi. Wow, how wonderful. This week, you get to pick what the groomsmen will wear. So the looks are from Jaime's Haberdashery in downtown St. Paul. And the owner, Anthony Andler, joins us now. The best dressed man in the Twin Cities. Isn't he a fabulous looking fella? Fail. Keeping up appearances. Look you're at looking that. Good, Boy, it's nice to Thanks have for you. having me. Okay, so you're going to get to vote for the groomsmen's looks, but first we want to see the groom, okay? Right. So he's yep. wearing a suit from Jaime, so let's welcome Matt. Okay. Come on out, Mr. Groom. Here comes the groom. <laughs> oh, looking snazzy. Boy, and Anthony here looking uh, looking modern. You know what I mean? This is They're a modern take. Tailored fit, yep. close to the body, yeah. nice lines. We, he came in with an idea and left with a different idea once he visited what was the store. The, how did yeah, the idea so, change? So color, right? Uh, yeah. Color, we always want to try on colors to see how they affect our, our physique and our look and our hair right. color and our skin tone, all that stuff. And so you can come in with a preconceived notion of what you're going to actually get. Yeah. yeah. But when we tried colors, we tried a navy on him, and then we tried this gray on him, and the gray just really complimented him very nicely. Matt, how do you feel in gray with a beautiful navy blue tie? You know, I really like it. I, I feel like a million bucks. Oh, mm -hmm. and that's how you want to feel on your wedding day. You've got yep. 30 days until the big day. How are you guys doing? You know, the nerves are starting to set in a little yeah. bit. It's starting to become really real. Yeah. So. But uh, we're doing good, though. You know, you've got to just look great, and that feels good. Anthony, talk to me about this idea of a suit. We did this at our wedding, too. Yeah. My husband did suits instead of tuxes, and then all the guys had great suits that they could carry on throughout their lives. That's popular? Yep. Yeah, I mean, I'm thinking the benefit of, of owning a suit and having a suit mm -hmm. and having it tailored fit for you. Yeah. Uh, the residual is long term. So totally. it, it can start a wardrobe. You can build off of that. And uh, the tuck still has its place. Yeah. Uh, it just depends on the setting. Sure. And and uh, you know what sort of what you want to accomplish within that wedding venue. So. I'm loving the look. I love the gray and the navy. That looks fantastic. And I'm so glad to hear Matt say that he feels so good. Feels like a million bucks because it's amazing when you put on a jacket that fits just right for the first time. If you put on one that really fits you, you feel so confident. All right, Matt. Uh, we're going to have you go over here. Yes. And then we're going to check out your groomsmen. Okay, but first, so we are going to need your help voting for the groomsmen's looks, you guys. So you're going to go to our website and you're going to be able to vote for those. And we want to remind you of what the bridesmaid dress looked like that we voted on and that we all got to choose, right? Pretty. This is a navy color. Can we pull that up, you guys? Do we have the photo of the bridesmaid dress? There it Beautiful. is. So when you're looking at these looks that the groomsmen are wearing, you want to think about what's going to go best with that dress. So Matt has two best men. Mark is out here first. Mark is Matt's cousin. And tell us about his look, Anthony. Well, so what we did is we had about two hours of, of fun fest and fabric at the store. <laughs> oh, boy. Is that possible? <laughs> yeah, sure it's is. So fun fest and fabric. And we tried on different things that complemented, again, the texture, the physique, the, the what Kay wanted to accomplish. Yeah. And once we put it all together, we took a picture, yeah. kind of recontextualized the look so that we had unique looks uh, both for the groomsmen and then a unique look for their special day, the bride and the groom. This navy is yeah. sharp. Boy, yeah. this sharp and, and the nice tones of the blue. Different t tones of blue with the pocket square to the tie. That's nice. Great, really good. great time of year to use these these color tones and it's it's been a real popular combination. Look so. at that, one of the best men. He's looking like a best man there. Indeed he is. Thank you so much, Mark. Mark, as you said, is one of two best men. Uh, Kevin makes up the other half. Come on out, Kevin. Now, Kevin has got a, uh, a blush accoutrement. Yeah, he, so what we're trying to accomplish here is an overall look. We, sure. want, we, want, to, we want to compliment the bridesmaids. So uh, in this voting, uh, uh, I think what we need to do is... Uh, Give us a strategy, yeah, Anthony. Yeah, I mean, what, what, do I, what do I say? Do I, I can't put words in Kay's mouth. It's, up, it's really the bride's <laughs> choice, but we're going to break some rules and let you vote. <laughs> yeah. And so if you want to vote, uh, vote blush, 
one eight hundred blush. One eight hundred blush. That is an that incorrect number. number. No, Do you not call it. We're something not inappropriate. Do yeah, not right. call that. Yeah. Right. But this blush look is a really pretty. I, I do like this for especially this winter wedding vibe that yes. we're going for yep. because I think it just looks lovely. It's soft. It's neutral. Yeah. Yep. Oh, look, and Kevin is another one of uh, Matt's cousins. How about that? Well, they're all family. good looking. I can't. I can't. This whole group. Yeah. By the this way, guy is the one who's going to get the party started when the when, when they're saying we need somebody to get the dance floor going. It's yeah. going to be Kevin. He's I actually just security. <laughs> <laughs> he is. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, right? Thank you, Kevin. You Thanks. look great in blush. One eight hundred blush is safe. One nine hundred blush. Hey, I take donations safe. too, so. Uh, <laughs> hey, finally, we have got, don't call me Donald, my name is Don. Don. Don, the man Hi. wearing a little paisley mm, today. Okay. Now, paisley uh, is fun because it can look very classic and throwback and very modern all the same. Again, across the board, these looks are traditional. You can't go wrong with any one of these choices. But yes, paisley is a traditional uh, a dress for you know, weddings and for all different types of occasions. I could tell you another story about Paisley's, but we'll do that another Let's time. Let's do that another time. Yeah, but this bright blue Paisley. Looks is, great, pops. This is it's, good. It's such, it's such a way to offset the colors. So Don and Matt have been friends for 15 years. He's gonna stand up there on his special day. It's fun to get to meet all the groomsmen and the bridesmaids ahead of time. Fantastic, mm -hmm. thank you, Don. You yeah, you great. head over with the Hang groomsmen and the Matt. Kitchen. Now, it, it's cool because you can, of course, you can always go there if you have a, a wedding coming up and you wanna take the groomsmen there, that's perfect. If you just need a suit and you realize, wait a minute, these don't fit me well, I love Jaime's. Jaime's is a place where you thank go. Thank you. And they, yeah. they just take great care of you. And I always say that when you walk in there, if you haven't been there, when you walk inside, it's like stepping in through some sort of a, a time warp. It's fantastic. You get taken back to the 20s and the 30s. It feels different, but uh, it's throwback again with these modern interpretations. And Anthony That's and the gang, they're going to take a great care of you. So Thank let's you. see all of our groomsmen. Let's see all three groomsmen with Matt. And what you get to do is pick which look matches up best with our groom. So head to TwinCitiesLive.com. Pick option one of the blue stripes. Option two is the blush. Or option three is the paisley. We will share the winning look next Wednesday. And a big thanks to the wedding guys for sponsoring Twin Cities Live and helping Matt. Uh, in case big day become all so perfect. And if you know someone who's engaged, make sure they know about the Wedding Guys Unveiled event. It's coming up Sunday, March 4th at the Minneapolis Convention Center. It's described as a day of bridal eye candy, features more <laughs> than 130 vendors, and you can get 50% off tickets. You just need to use the promo code TCL online, and you can learn more about that on our website. Coming up next.